today I'll be talking about lifting mechanics because in every day there's a lot of times that we need to pick up heavy objects. For example, this table in front of me. How do you actually lift it? A lot of times, unknowingly or unconsciously, you will be doing this. Like you will hunch back, okay? And then you just lift like this. Actually, this is not a very good body movement to lift in heavy objects because when the moment you bend down like this, the center of gravity shift and hence, by picking up this heavy object, it will cause overloading, overstressing over your back muscles. It can cause you injuries. The most common way and recommended by people, it will be the deadlift method. So how it works is by hip hinge, soft bend your knee, keeping your back straight, yeah? You're gonna bend forward, okay? Slightly squatting down, and then you keep the object close to yourself, and you lift up, okay? This is the most recommended way. However, today I'm going to share with you another two methods that actually can be incorporated into you lifting the heavy weights. For example, movement number one is called the squat movement. So how you do it here is by keeping your body straight, yeah? you're just going to bend your knee all the way down by lifting this heavy object up. When you come back to the table, so what you need to do in this squatting is by opening up your leg. It's like a sumo squat. Okay, so you're just going to Go body straight down, okay, and put your hand over the table and you lift up. Okay, another second movement is the lunges. Okay, just one knee in front, another leg behind by bending your leg down. This arm you're gonna support thing on this half kneeling knee, and then you're gonna pick up the object, transfer the load on the opposite hand as the hand is resting on the leg, and then you're gonna just push your body up. There's actually a lot of ways and methods in lifting objects in our daily lives. It is not only one possible method like I mentioned before. It is um, highly depending on the environmental safety at that moment and how your body feels in lifting that object up. So for example, if you feel that your back is aching more, what this suggests is you do the squatting by keeping your back straight, okay? Or if you feel that the knee's gonna hurt more, you have problem with your knees, what you'll do is by hip hinge and then just bend your forward, bend your body forward down. Why hip hinge? Because hip hinge allow the most possible force channel down to the ground and will help you in your better body movements in carrying your weight. So that will be it. I hope you find this helpful tips. Thank you so much for watching. As today's video is just for educational purposes. However, if you do feel any pain while performing all these um, techniques, I would really, really recommend you to find a medical professional, physiotherapist, to get your body checked. Thank you.